Hello, and welcome to the Atlassian Demo Den, where we show you the newest improvements in Atlassian's cloud products. I'm David Michelson. I'm a product manager on the Atlassian Slack integrations team, where our mission is to make sure that Atlassian and Slack products work seamlessly together to save our customers valuable time from contact switching. Today, I'm going to show you one of the newest ways we're helping our customers save time with the Jira Slack integrations newest personal notifications feature. With it, instead of sifting through your email for important Jira updates, you can actually have them sent straight to Slack where you're already working. Let's hop right into the demo. Okay, to start getting Jira notifications straight in Slack rather than an email, you'll first need to make sure that you've installed the Jira Cloud for Slack app on your Slack workspace. To do that, simply go to the top left of Slack and click Apps, type in Jira Cloud into the search, and you'll find our official marketplace listing called Jira Cloud. Simply click on add, then click add to Slack to add the bot to your Slack workspace. Approve the permissions it requests by clicking on allow. And lastly, log into your Atlassian account to link up Slack and Jira. And there you go, you've set up the Jira Slack integration. You'll see that the Jira bot sent us a welcome message. We'll go ahead and click on that. Now to get started with personal notifications, you can either click on personal notifications in the welcome message the bot sends you, or you can always type in slash Jira notify. Hit enter, and we'll see a menu has come up to turn on personal notifications. Now we have a chance to cut through the noise by only picking the sorts of issues that we care about to get notified on. So let's say that we only care about issues that we're watching or that we're the assignee of. We'll unselect the other options and make sure we only get notified about what we care about. And there we go. We're set up to get notifications straight in Slack. Now let's see the personal notifications in action. Let's put ourselves in the shoes of our coworker, Alice. Alice sees a JIRA issue that I'm the assignee of, and she wants to give some feedback. Let's say that Alice says, I like this idea, and leaves a comment. Since I'm the assignee of this ticket, we'll notice that I got a Slack notification about Alice's comment. Let's check it out. And there it is. We can see that Alice commented on an issue we were assigned to without ever checking our email. We can also interact with the issue straight from Slack to avoid context switching. Let's reply to Alice. Thanks for the feedback. There we go. And lastly, we can always adjust the lever on how often we want to be notified. Just type in slash Jira notify and adjust your settings by clicking modify and then include more options to get more notifications, or you can include less to clear out the noise. That's it for our demo of personal notifications. Please let us know if you have any feedback or questions, we're happy to answer. Um, and remember to get started, just make sure you have the Jira Cloud for Slack app installed and then type in slash Jira notify, and you'll be one step closer to never checking your email again. Lastly, to end it off here, I wanted to answer a spicy question from the community. We've had a few users ask uh, for more advanced filtering options on personal notifications. We think this is super interesting feedback and we are still collecting more and more, trying to figure out what you all find noisy versus what you find important. In the meantime, I can suggest using our subscription feature slash Jira Connect instead of slash Jira Notify to try and get those more advanced options. That's it. Thank you all for watching the Atlassian Demo Den, and I'll see you next time.